Hey, what's up guys? So, back with some more hardcore series. My favorite series that I have right now. Nothing against Kaizo Caverns, but it's hard. And I don't like it much. I mean, I like the map. It's just, I suck at it. So, it makes me feel bad. So, in the last episode, it was pretty much just a big waste of time. Just to make that big, stupid monument there for my old cat. And another thing you should note is I'm on the new snap, or not snapshot, but the new release, which is 2.4. And in this release, the cats get super annoying, and they'll start sitting on top of my chests and stuff. And they'll sit on the bed. And we have a couple new sandstone blocks, and a couple new wooden plank blocks. So, I had a retarded cat, and as you can see, I'm, I can't access this chest now, so you have to like push the cat off, like get him out here, and then try it, I don't know, <coughs> it'll be interesting, so I'm going to go ahead and make them sit, like I'm going to actually have to get them off the bed and sit, because if I don't, then they're going to be just teleporting to me and stuff and I don't want that. If you notice a uh, change in my voice, I got my new mic this well, this afternoon. And that's pretty cool. Um I think what I want to do is I'm just going to I'm going to sum up that whole last episode and just screw it and s just write it here. There we go. I don't even want these blocks here with special or anything like that. So, and or in this episode, I wanted to go over there and finish up the mine or our little path towards the mine. And I don't know what I'm going to do as far as the the whole situation goes as far as wood cuz I'd like to keep this this kind of wood and I know I mean I can find the regular trees throughout like here's one right here but these trees are gonna give me a more darker red kinda look and I don't know if that's gonna be something that I like more in the end or something that I don't want at all so I'm gonna have to kind of experiment with it a little bit but as for right now I do know that there's just a little bit more of a lake um, on the other side of that over there so we're gonna need a couple more things to uh, finish up the or finish a bridge over there and then we can start creating our mine and we grab some cobblestone we can put our hoe up and it is getting dark which I'm not sure if I want to do or not because I'd recommend not dying but then again, I haven't really seen any action. I would be good with eating if I could. So, let's get a quick snack and we'll head back over there. So, what do we have? Bread. That could work. Alright, so I'll just wait for some more of this to grow but it's not going to be able to right now because it's dark but it'll grow don't worry about it so let's sprint over here and we did start the bridge so that's good hopefully there's no just random monsters over here just ready to just jump out and beat the crap out of me and I want to know what what it was here one two three four five six so we'll continue the same pattern here. This is three, four, five, six, and there we go. So one here, one here, wood, wood, torch, torch. There we go. <coughs> and once again, if you didn't watch my last video, you're going to notice that my voice might still be a little bit weird sounding. And that's just because I'm still a little bit sick from over the weekend. Um, 
but that's not going to stop me from making videos cuz I'm too cool for that. 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 I don't know where I'm getting my numbers from now. Wait, 1 2 3 4 5 6. Okay, never mind. I thought I did something wrong. 2 and then we're going to have a bunch of like vines and stuff in the way. So let's clear out some of this. One, two, three, four. And let's cut down this. Do I have a shovel? I don't think I've ever made a shovel in this series anyway. So, if that was four or five, then we can put it on the entrance right here. So let's dig some of this out. <coughs> and normally I do my mines three wide, but I guess I'll just do mine two um, here, and maybe we'll open it up more once we get down into the lower sections. So, we are going to keep it three tall though, because I do want it to be three tall. Alright, so this is one, two, three, four, five, six. And then break this one and this one. Here, 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 here. And then we'll even keep the whole wood thing going here. Alright, now I can actually start mining. Let's put wood here. And give it that kind of look to where it actually looks like there's wood behind it. No, I don't want that there. Alright, so that looks bad, but we'll do something with it later. So let's start mining. And <coughs> probably for the sake of the series and being bored, I'm probably not going to film me doing all the mining just because that's really boring. And I mean, you gotta get to, into it at some point, but I don't know if it would be better for me to show you guys what I'll get, or if it would be better just to go ahead and skip it in general, because it's not gonna be that fun. And it's gonna be really boring to do on camera, because I've gotta find stuff to talk about during it, and then you guys have gotta sit there and watch me sit there and break block after block after block with my pickaxe, and it's just not going to be a fun experience. So, I think what I'll do is I'll probably just do all my mining off camera. And I mean, if I find anything like <coughs> super important or like a big cave system or something, I'll definitely like pop in and show you guys what I found. But all of my like upper world stuff will be done on camera, and all my underworld kind of things will be done just in the safety of my house as in my real life house I'll not record it I'll know what's going on but you know whatever so we are gonna dig down just a little bit just to get the mine started and I think that'll be good for today and um, I could do some mining today but I'm not sure if I want to or not just because I don't know if I'm feeling up to it and I feel like there could be some stuff we could do around here like not fall off the bridge um... so what can I do? I, I'd like to get a... there's a spider yeah take that kitty in the window 
but I'd like to make a not a sugarcane farm, but I'd like to make a bookcase room for my enchantment table sometime down the road. I'd like to get it done as soon as possible because I really hate making enchantment rooms. I've made like 300 of them in the time that the enchantment table's been out, and it's not that fun any of the times. Just because it's one of those things where after you make 9,000 bookcases, you'd never want to see another bookcase again. So, it's going to be one of those things that I'm not really going to enjoy doing. So, there's 11 books just, just to go ahead and get started. I'll go ahead and show you guys some of the different wood. There's some redder wood, and you can see that it's not going to switch with that. So, I could actually try to put some like darker wood or some kind of wood around the edges of this since I've made that carpet just out of random sake of time last last episode. So I could do that, but I'm still not completely sure. But if anything, I want to go out and find some birch trees because overall birch trees have always been my favorite kind of tree in Minecraft and with the new kind of a wood system where it gives you a lighter wood from birch trees. It just makes it that much cooler. So, I'll probably go out and find some birch trees at some point. And, as you can tell, that's a jungle biome, so I'm not going to be able to find any in there. And, that's a swamp biome, so none in there either. And, I'd like to go exploring as much as possible in this world, just because it's not going to be fun if I don't know what's around me and what I can go do in this area. Because I would love to find an NPC village, and preferably one nearby, just because I love restoring the towns, because most of them get messed up in the process anyway. Like, you'll find the, like, roads that are made out of gravel, like, unwalkable, because, like, it falls off a cliff or some, some, something. Um, but yeah, I'd like to do something like that, too. But it just depends on whether I can find what I'm looking for. Here's some chickens, actually, which I don't have in my regular little area. Nice little secret cave room here. That's actually really cool. I like how it's already, like, fitted for, like, a chest here and a crafting area here. and That's really cool. Wish I would have found this. Another thing I like are lily pads. We're probably going to do something with lily pads somewhere around later because honestly I don't even know what I'm going to do with them I just like the look of them and I like that you can walk across water with them so we'll probably do something with that that'd actually be some kind of cool if we made the bridge out of lily pads because then we can just have it have kind of like a natural look to it but it won't be like anything like too self-generated looking and we have a snow biome over there which is not good. I hate snow. I've never been a fan. I mean, snow in real life's cool, yeah. Everything's cool about snow in real life, but snow on Minecraft, no. One, it freezes your water. And if you have a farm going, that sucks. Two, if you're just sitting there and you just randomly see it, like snowing, I mean, that's kind of cool. That's the only good thing about it. But instead of that, it just covers up the ground and you have to like go around and like fix all of your grass and stuff again which is not cool because it just takes up a whole lot of time that you could be doing spending it on something else so while I'm in this little swamp biome I might as well just grab as many uh, lily pads as possible I'm really regretting not making a shovel by the way because there's some clay and stuff I mean yeah I could harvest it with my fist but I'm not really in that big of a need of clay right now anyway, so I think I'll just leave it here for now and we'll come back and get it at some point. So, it is an interesting land terrain kind of thing around here. Like, I like how our jungle biome is, like, massive. And then, like, we have a couple of uh, connecting biomes around it. Not the whole ice biome or snow biome, because... That sucks in general. 
I mean, some of you guys may like the snow biomes, but honestly, I could care less. Like, I like the taiga biomes, because they ha because they have um, the whole, those kind of trees. <laughs> taiga trees, or, I don't know what you would call them. I guess they're pine trees, because I guess regulars are oak, and then it's birch, and then these would be pine, and then I don't know what the actual name for jungle trees would be. But I guess for Minecraft's sake, it would be just jungle trees. And we broke an axe, which is not good. Uh, wait, dirt. Easier to break. I do want some of this, because this is what I'm probably going to surround my carpet in, just because it's darker, and it gives it more of a decorative kind of look to it. Like, just look how dark that is compared to that right there. I think it'll look a lot nicer. Speaking of which, if I do find a birch tree, I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take the saplings off of it and then kind of make a a farm sort of thing around my house. And I'll have every kind of tree just so I can have every kind of wood whenever I need it. So, iron here, just, just ripe for the picking. Picking, because I'm using a pick. Ha! Either way. So, grab it. And I would grab the coal. Eh. I don't want it right now. I know later I'll be like, oh yeah, I need some coal. And I'll be like, oh yeah, I regret that. But, either way. I would kill some pigs, but I think I'll probably need to come back and get them and hurt them or something later. So now we're back in this massive jungle biome. And I'm probably not even going to be able to find my way back home, honestly. It's going to suck. Like, I understand that I can probably just go this way and find the coast. But, I don't know. So, as far as I can tell, if we go that way, it's going to be snow biome. If we head out straight from my house, as far as I can tell, it's an ocean. If we head this way, it's m way more jungle than I want. Um, I mean, jungle biomes are cool and all, it's just... This is like... 800 football fields worth, which is not cool. I mean, I like smaller jungle biomes. It would have been cool if I would have been on like a island or something that had a jungle biome, but then I wouldn't have any other biomes around me. It would just be a big ocean, which would suck. So I guess either way, this is this is pretty good. And if we go that way, it's pretty much going to be basically the same as going that way. It's just going to be kind of like an ocean because I haven't really explored that way that much. So. Um, oh, there's my house. Interesting. Alright, so. Um, what can we do? I guess this is just an exploring episode. Also, I'd like to do something with the big trees. I mean, I don't want to build a tree house because, like, every person in America has built a tree house now um, out of these bigger trees. But I would like to do something with them. I don't know what, though. Like, I think it would be kind of cool to make, like, an interesting version of, like, a mob trap. Or, not a mob trap, but a, uh, a mob spawner. I think it would be interesting to make kind of, like, a version of that with these. But I'm not completely sure. Like, I don't know how you would do it. So, I'll leave that up to another day. And just to make sure, I do want to come up here to this coastal area and just look over into this direction. Just to see if I can find anything. I'd like to see if there's any land generation over there. And also, I don't want to generate too much land, just because if in a future update they decide to add like a brand new biome, just like the jungle biomes, I would like to be able to like go somewhere, like explore way further out there, and try to find a newer biome or something like that. Which I doubt they'll make a new biome, considering we have so many already. But I mean, hey, they added the jungle biome in the middle of the new released, full released game, so I guess anything can happen jibs up to a lot of stuff. So, yeah. But like I said, I do want to start mining a little bit, and 
maybe we'll do some more exploration at some point maybe out that way or something because I do want to find a uh, village as soon as possible because one uh, uh, lag one I want to make a um, a golem farm or whatever you want to call it iron golem kind of farm thing where I can get as much iron as I want from those and secondly I want to restore the um, restore the village if it even needs restoring so let's throw some junk in here and let's fit it like this um, something I want to ask you guys would you care if I added the convenient inventory or inventory tweaks or whatever just for the sake of me being able to like organize my chest and everything I mean I know it's not that big of a deal but I think it would be something that I would like and maybe anybody else who likes organized things would enjoy because I like to, like I've used it a lot uh, with uh, most of the packs that I use like DNS pack and I've used the Yog box and all that and all those have that in there so I'd like to be able to um, like organize my inventory whenever but I mean if you guys want me to keep this like totally vanilla then that's like totally fine I mean obviously it's not totally vanilla because I have to use Optifine to um, make my full screen uh, 720 but you know if you want this to be as vanilla as possible and me not get what I want by organizing inventory space which doesn't seem like too big of a deal then feel free to say something in the comment section below so I didn't start my timer so I have no idea how long this episode is right now but I'm gonna guess it's been pretty long because I explored, I made my mind, and I looked around and kinda got a view of everything. And I know I haven't done much this episode or last episode, but once we start mining I think we'll really start to get some good profit and everything. So this is kinda like the lower end of the build up episodes that will eventually make um make this series what what it will be in like 200 years. Yeah, just kidding. Um, so let's, while we are on camera, let's go ahead and make us an iron pick, because I know we're going to need it later. And honestly, I think I'm just going to go ahead and keep using, um, keep using the, um, the whole stone pick kind of thing, because I know it's a lot easier to get stone picks, and... I think it would be well worth it if I just saved all my iron um, for another day. So, like, I have no problem with making an iron axe just because you're not going to use it quite as much. But a stone pick can be shot through in like half an episode, which would, like, for me is like eight minutes or so. Because I do mainly 15 to 20 minute episodes, maybe eight to ten minutes would be just like totally shattered way before then anyway so anyways thanks for watching guys um, hopefully you enjoyed the new mic I probably you can't even hear a difference in it and if you can then I'll try to work on that or if it's a good difference then awesome so anyways thanks for watching just like I said like two minutes ago and I'll see you guys in the next episode <laughs> Come <laughs> on.